uh, little off subject. We're gonna talk about Bill Cosby. Because I'm gonna calm down TV, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey, did you uh, hear about the Bill Cosby getting uh, found guilty of the accusations? Uh, yeah, dog, I heard about that. Yeah, for sure. Wanna know, did you happen to get a notification on your phone? Um, I probably did receive some type of notification, like popped up on like YouTube or something like that, Complex News or something, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I, I probably did receive something like that, yeah. Is that something you get regularly from, like, do you hear about people just getting <laughs> locked up, popping up? Man, just, you know, uh, as, yeah, I do actually just hear about people getting locked up, you know what I mean? That's, I mean, but does it pop up on your phone as a notification? Does it pop up on my phone as a notification? No, it does not. No, it does not. Um, no. No, that does not happen. You know, this yeah. was a unique situation with, with Dr. Cosby. Y'all know he's actually a doctor. Yeah. Put that out there, Dr. Cosby. Feel me? Yeah. Well, I just found that it was odd to me. Anyway, I said, well, I thought back and I said maybe because he, like you said, he is Dr. Cosby. He's all in, man. So you feel me? Yeah. Maybe it's because he's who he is. But I felt like there's tons of white. Famous folks that go to court and we don't, I ain't never got a notification on my phone saying, hey, he got like, he, he guilty. You know, that's a really good point, man, because that just kind of speaks on just maybe maybe some of the conspiracies that are out here, you know, regarding people uh, of color that have money or have reached a certain level of success, you know what I'm saying? Um, it, it is unfortunate, though, you know what I mean, because we do have people in certain political positions in, in this country right now who have not really received any repercussions for the negative behavior that they have exhibited, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So it, it kind of sucks on behalf of Bill Cosby, you know what I mean? But, uh, you know, God give his, 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 his toughest battles to his strongest soldiers, you know what I'm saying, and shit. You know, Bill, Bill is a good dude, you feel me? So, man, we're going to pray for him and, and make sure... Hope sure everything work out for the best for him, you know what I mean? Definitely. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, now, life has a lot of ups and downs. He not the only one to go through stuff. We all go through things. That a bit, yeah. What's maybe one thing in your life that made you who you are today? Man. To be honest, bro, I would just have to say my entire life, you know what I mean? My, my entire life has just been, I feel like trying to ready me for that moment of truth you dig what i'm saying like you know i know one day i'm gonna finally be where i want to be but you know you might not be able to handle certain situations in life if you hadn't been through certain stuff you know what i'm saying so i just look at my entire life my entire from the moment i was born up until this very second on this couch right now man that's just teaching me man it's just getting ready getting me ready you dig what i'm saying so, mm -hmm. okay yeah that's how i feel about that okay yeah bro what up, Cashville? It's your boy, Q-Ball, you feel me? 615, 61 fever till I leave, or 615 till I live. And you're watching me right now on Calm Down TV. Follow me on IG at Johnny Cashville one 615, you dig? And shh, get it.